Ricky Lee, Tim and Joel on Nova. What have you seen in the world of doctors? Doctor, doctor. Dr. John, John, calling Dr. Oh, John. Great song. What about this? Ready for this? Guess who this is? Clear! <laughs> Call the nurse. Lee Hardy. Call the nurse. Oh my gosh! Oh my. <laughs> I'm in He'll be pain. thrilled with his 30 cents. I'm in pain. <laughs> Everything <laughs> Oh, that's a good lyric. Call the nurse, call the nurse. Everything I'm in pain because everything hurts. Oh, my God. It's like Shakespeare. I'll write that um, down and have a day off. Well, all those songs <laughs> were very appropriate because hospitalizations for foreign objects in rectums are on the rise. What? I'm sorry, what? Yeah, this is right up your alley, but <laughs> maybe mind yourself I'm just here. Gonna, I'm just going to shut up for a second. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> maybe, you should, maybe you just watch this one. <laughs> yeah, so a new study has suggested hospitalizations for foreign objects um, in the uh, tukas are on the rise. The oh, study the was in the done between... Well, I said it says bum. say it. Okay. We say, it, we say everything on this show. I've noticed. <laughs> um, so between 2012 and 2021, there were 38,900 and 48 emergency department visits in the US alone. Yeah. So of these reported cases, the average age was 43. So apparently that's the age you start experimenting. (laughs) Next year's my year. (laughs) Well, black is get this. 78% of patients were male as well. 43-year-old males. Weird, weird weird things. Like I saw a story about a light light bulb. Yes. um, Why would you do that? Well, the majority was were session toys, yeah. um, but other common objects found were balls, marbles, marbles. and drugs. <laughs> oh, and drugs. Okay, that's And fine. drugs. Okay. Yeah. you got to keep them somewhere. Um, <laughs> marbles. I know. That's what? Was oh, it a big boy? <laughs> Remember the big boy? <laughs> oh, the big boy marble. <laughs> yeah. Like, hey, was it like a big a, boy? Like a gobstopper. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what are marbles called? Mar- I used to love marbles, but now I don't know how to play anymore. Well, mainly because I've got the internet. <laughs> yeah, I don't think um, there are that many rules. I think you could pick it, pick it up pretty quick. No, but what do you do? Though? Are you supposed to flick it to the world, the big boy? Yeah, it's like, um, what's it called? Coits? Not coits. What's the one <laughs> no. you play? What, up the coit? <laughs> no, no, what's just... the one you play in the backyard where you throw the little ball? And, oh, bocce. Uh, um, bocce. Oh, mm. bocce. Yeah. Oh, I'd rather play coits. <laughs> what's coits? Is that like hoopla? No, it's a, what is a little coit? It's a coit yeah. that goes over a stick. Not hoopla. Oh. It's coits. Oh, okay, I don't know. What's hoopla? Know, it's old fashioned game. We were you trying to get <laughs> hoopla yeah. to a stick. Yeah, sometimes oh, we me and my friends. When I was at school. When I used to drive our penny farthings down to local coit place. <laughs> <laughs> Collect all your marbles, which you've since lost. Um, Up the bum. Zing. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> I said, what, what? That's where in they the all butt. are. I said, what, what? In, in the, the butt. butt. I, I was wondering what, what? why you jingle while you're walking around the office. Jingle. Um, okay, let's go to sachet around. the actual doctors. Yeah. Hello, Hannah. You're a nurse. Welcome Hi. to the show. Hi. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm an emergency nurse and have seen lots Oof. of things at bottom. But mm-hmm. I think okay. the top would be a doorknob. A doorknob? <gasps> hang on, hang on. Are you saying that's the most common or that's the weirdest thing you've seen? Oh, I think that's the weirdest. The most okay. common are apples. What? <laughs> How on earth is it? What? Well, wait, wait, wait. I'm a Granny Smith guy or a Pink Lady guy. Oh, yeah, you can't get well. a pink lady anywhere, <laughs> well, can you? Apparently you can. Yep. Also, but do, what, what, what do these people say? What's the most common thing they say when they come? Again. <laughs> <laughs> what do they say? Do they try and, like... You can just tell. They're just a bit stuck. They're a type. You, mm. you just pull them in and then they're like, yep, that's okay. what and I've Hannah- got up there. Hannah, do you say an apple a day keeps the doctor away? <laughs> Not in your case. <laughs> we have said that before, yeah. Oh, brilliant work. Great Fun stuff. Are life. you off to work now or what's the go? Is this your just day finished. off? Oh, just yeah. finished, of just course. Finished. Yeah, back to work yeah. about midnight? Yeah. <laughs> Great. Oh, good on Thank you, you Hannah. Hannah. We love you guys. Sunny, hello. Hello, how's it going? Really good. You saw something in hospital. Why? Are you a patient? Do you work in the profession? Um, I was actually doing placement in a hospital as a dietitian. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Um, and so there was this patient, I didn't see him myself, but, you know, word kind of gets around. Mm-hmm. He put in a, let's like say, here. a long object, um, 
uh, up his backside and perforated his bowel. <gasps> and so he was put on a stoma bag because the food obviously can't pass through the bowel if it's perforated. Oh, yeah. No. Um, and then his wife came in and was like, oh, why does he have a stoma bag? Like, what's happened? So he's obviously <sighs> hiding something. Oh my god! We're hiding two things. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder what it was, like a hockey stick or something. Can you say, Sonny? Oh, it was just a toy, just a long toy. Oh, a long, long toy. toy. Oh, a long toy. Marital aid, eh? Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Not in this case. Ricky Lee, Tim and Joel on Nova.